so cute but so evil so cute but so evil hey how you guys doing animal noodle here and today we're going to make the case as to why otters are criminals in the animal kingdom otters are small carnivorous mammals with some of the thickest fur in the animal kingdom being found on every continent of course excluding antarctica and australia there are many types of otters that goes as follows Minor differences exist amongst them. Now, from a surface level view, otters seem like a cute, cuddly animal with cute tendencies, such as holding hands while sleeping, using tools to crack open shells, and even juggling and playing with rocks. But what if I told you all otters are evil, mean, killing machines? You wouldn't believe me, but I am here making that very case, with my first point being, attack on humans. A 2011 study found 39 reports of otters attacking humans, most of these cases taking place after 1980. And shockingly enough, the reports grew as the decades passed, from 3 in the 1980s, 13 in the 1990s, and 17 in the 2000s. Although to be fair, 46% of attacks in the 1980s included rabies, while only 24% in the 2000s included rabies. And while attacks are bad, one otter incident in India was reported to be deadly. Still not convinced? That's okay, just keep watching. Reason number two, they are a menace to any and every animal that they cross paths with and not in a predatory type of way, but more in a Ted Bundy or John Wayne Gacy type of way, which if you lived under a rock and didn't know, are famous serial killers. As otters, specifically sea otters, have been observed killing without feeding. In fact, 19 cases were documented of sea otters attacking, raping, and killing baby seals. Yes, you heard that right, raping. But otters are not only a threat to baby seals, this mini monster kills or attacks everything. Here are just some cases. You can find his videos in full, they will be linked in the description, be sure to check them out. If that it wasn't enough to sell you as to why otters are evil, here are a couple more reasons. As mentioned before, sea otters are known to rape baby seals, but that same aggression also occurs in breeding, as said by researchers. Quote, in one prior report on breeding associated mortality, a tagged territorial male sea otter held a struggling female underwater until her body became limp and then copulated repeatedly with her carcass. Ten months later, the same male was observed with the carcass of yet another female. In both cases, the male was swimming, diving, guarding, and copulating with the carcass. Gruesome stuff from these little criminals. And for the last point, or the cherry on top, male otters are known to hold pups ransom to force mothers to give up some type of food. Biologists describe the event as so. A male approached a pup floating on the surface while the mother was diving for food. The male then forced the pup underwater as if trying to drown it. And as the female surfaced, the male stole her clam and the female retreated. This is the equivalent of going to the grocery store, finding a woman with a small child, then putting a gun to the kid's head until the mom gives you food. And that concludes my case as to why otters are one of the most, if not the most, evil animal in the animal kingdom. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing for more content.